this thing why not hey jeremy what's up it's me i'm live i think i was supposed to be live two minutes ago but these things happen anyways uh let me go ahead and uh, get my game set up here uh close this preview window pop into here so i started playing this um actually uh, yesterday was it i think it was yesterday and um i'm still on the first mission which is basically um, that Geralt has wandered into a town, and in the town there's a griffin problem, and um, they need somebody to uh, murder the griffin. Um, the griffin has been uh, uh, swooping down and killing like merchants and shit on the road, you know? And so the town has hired me to do that, and uh, the ultimate reason I'm here is because I'm chasing Yennefer. Uh, Yennefer's this girl that he's uh, in love with. And so, um, uh, yeah, so uh, that's where I'm, I'm at right now. Uh, let's see where this goes. Turn down my TV and shit. I don't have any extra sounds going on. Okay, continuing. This card's tale begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seems just a few steps ahead. Hey, what a paper! I like, it seems like every single time I um, I start the game, they have a little cutscene like this, which roughly describes where I'm at in the game, which that's pretty nice, you know? So this is White Orchard. You can see um, up in the corner, you can see like my mini map and um, none of the peasants really matter. Good idea, so, good so idea. They really don't say anything important. Let's see. And then all over the place there's shit like flowers like this, you know, which are good for uh, crafting later. So I just kind of ground, but I don't um, go through like trouble of trying to kill, uh, uh, get everything, you know. But I will grab flowers if like the right there. Don't kill a cow? Okay, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. So I've done um, a lot of the missions already in this town. What I've been doing is doing everything up until killing the beast. And I've done like every mission in town except for... If you look at the map, there's um, a bunch of spots to discover still. See all these spots? And so I've been kind of hunting them out, just sort of one at a time, you know? Hey, Mixon, how you doing? Let's see, the game is amazeballs, but it also has like 600 hours of side quests that give lore about the world. Yeah, that's fine by me. I like side quests. I like side quests. I, you know what got me playing this was I played Witcher 2. I played through Witcher 2 like I don't know a couple times. I mean, it was a pretty good game. Uh, but what got me into it is I watched the uh, the Witcher series recently, and it was so fucking good that I'm like, you know, I I, I kind of want to go back and give the games a chance again. And now it's much easier for me to appreciate this game um, compared to before, where before I was just kind of like um, just playing through it. Now it's like I kind of get a better idea of who Geralt's character is and who Yennefer is and what they mean to each other, whereas before they were just characters, you know? You put like 300 hours into it? Cool, man. All right, hold on. Come on now. Where was I going? I think I was going that way. To my right. I'm just hunting out, um, yeah, I'm hunting out just, uh, things I haven't done yet, you know what I mean? I've been to most of these cabins and already like ransacked them just for, like they're crap, you know? Whoa there, Roach! Left. Make sure I didn't need to face to the right, you know what I mean? So, it says that girl... He always slows down for the bridges, it seems. So it seems like a Geralt, it says Let's he go. always names his horses Roach. Does that mean that they die sometimes and he just gets new ones and names them Roach? And why does he name them Roach? Don't worry, I'll kill him. So those are Drowners. Um, they don't need any explanation. You can tell what Drowners are. Uh, let's see. You get the cow demon if you kill too many, you have no hope. Really? Do I still play GTA? Not so much lately. Um, just kind of bored of it. Played it for too many years, you know what I mean? So, um, I've been playing more, um, just, uh, RPGs and, uh, a lot of, like, online, uh, multiplayer kind of games. 
kind of things, you know? Just let it burn for a minute. Hi, buddy. What are you guys doing? Roach resurrects because roaches are hard to kill. Oh, is that the idea? All right, so Drowner Brain, Drowner Tongue. Um, everything drops ingredients, and um, I imagine it's for potions and bombs and stuff like that. But for now, I just kind of grab everything, you know. All right, there's a potion in the water in there. A Tamarian Lily Key. I take it it's for the chest in the water. Get that thing. Oh, it's popcorn. I haven't had a lot of reason to be afraid of underwater yet, but who knows if one day I'm gonna go swimming and there's gonna be like a freaking, you know, a monster. Okay, Florin, Silver Amber Necklace, Tamarian Special Forces, Insignia. It's a, obviously a whole cart that went over the side. People drowned. Alright, so that wasn't really a quest. It was just like a thing that was just like lying there, you know what I mean? Oh, game sounds a little off time. Hold on, I think I know what that might be. One second. I had it set for a thing on another thing. Is it still that way? Yes. I think I know what it is. Okay. Now try the game sounds. Does it sound better? They might have been off by 650 milliseconds. That's the delay that an Elgato has, so I had it set for that, but I don't have the Elgato on right now, so I had to turn off the delay. That's probably what you're hearing. All right. Um, what's near me? I already killed the, um, I already, I already killed the, the Wraith that's inside this place of power. I also already killed the, um, the noon wraith. There was this wraith that was attached to. It was um, uh, um. It's this. It was a a, a ghost that was circling this well, and uh, when you went there, you found out that um, the reason it's it's the well it's haunting is because it's a lady that used to live there, and the local like mayor, you know, came through and um, and fucking burned down some of her shit. So she sued to the government. The government told the mayor, "You owe her money." And so the mayor came down there to, like, you know, like, make amends. And instead he hung her um, inside of her well from the little bucket uh, rope. And so that's why her ghost haunts that place because of the wrong that was done to her. So, um, so I, I went and I fixed that. Um, that took a lot of, like, specifics to kill um, the, the wraith. But it was cool. All right, so let's go see what this is. Let's go see what this is. Is behind me. Hey, he ran across the thing that time. He always seems to like slow down on the um on the what's it called the uh, uh people right here on the bridges. All right, I'm just watching my map. Whenever there's like wolves and shit, they'll appear as red dots on your map. Place of power. <gasps> She'll draw from power. it. Oh, it's a way with this thing. Let's see if, uh, Yurden does anything there. Anything there. Hey, where are you going? Did you gain your health back already?
Um, they're not material except for at certain times. And so, like, if that little um, circle of paper that I put down, it's called a magic trap, and it um, it makes um, immaterial ghosts material for a second. And um, so uh, that was just kind of handy um, to do. Uh oh. I heard a dog. Did you hear a dog want to do that? Oh. Hey, whatever. And then I saw bees. There they are. So the bees, you can't really get the bees, but if you do like a flame like that, then the bees burn and then fall and turn into honeycomb and then you eat the honeycomb until they can see. The only damage of every spell works when she's in the circle. There you go. Yeah, the circle jacks her up. I keep hearing dogs when I do that. See? What's up with that? Is it like a thing? Like... Holy! Did we charge her? Lucky. Okay. So I got a point to spend, and my axie side is now stronger, which that's just handy. Alright, anything else near me right now? There's this. I might as well just keep moving across, you know what I mean? Okay, let's see. Okay, you remember, but I'll show by Yeah, it was the um it was the main way I was able to um kill the uh the the no the noon wraith, I think her name was. Well, let me look at my camera here and see what would be the best way to um, set up my OBS. May the force be with you. Okay. You can see it here. I need to raise the camera up a little bit. Hey, one second, guys. No, no, not that one. This one. Ah, there we are. See, if I raise it up here, then it's over all that text. Let's play Gwent progress in two more than once. Oh, I, I, um, I played Gwent for a minute, and I'm like, this sucks. I quit. I don't like it. <laughs> Like I, I imagine it's something that maybe if I, if I fucked with it for a while, I might get more into. But I, I got real bored with it. It's like a card game. Oh shit! I want to chop my horse up, huh? Arm flew off, buddy. I'll rip off your man and oh. shit down your neck. Oh. How cold! Oh. Top of a guy while he's um, got his mind in the flames. I wish you would stop shooting with the goddamn arrows. Oh. You know that's my favorite thing about these arrow guys. Is is they have like no armor so once you get through like the the actual melee guys the arrow dudes are just like waiting to get ripped up D uh, dumpling song chicken sandwich golden spirit the, the swords that i picked up were just rusty swords so i don't give a crap about those did you have to play oh i read that I do have the ability to parry arrows, but I find it just easier just to charge the fucking guy, you know? You take an arrow or two, unless they're like a really good archer, take a lot of damage, but they barely take any, so it's cool. I just charge them. So I got some florins, uh, lesser runestones, some silver for crafting, and then diagrams for Gravenel and a manuscript page for thunderbolts. I take it those are like, like recipes, you know what I mean? And if you hold your Witcher sight like that, it shows you um, relevant. It's like the Batman vision thing. But look at that. Oh, there's a dog up there. I can hear him this time. Alright, whatever. 
Old goat hide, amateur armor repair kit, some more orins. Anything else down here? Oh, there's this dude here. Every time I put on the thing, I can hear the dogs. It makes them seem like way closer than they are, you know? Oh, that one's actually close now. Hey, don't you fucking bite me, you butthole. How long are you gonna make me wait? The wolves are getting stronger. That's a little five wolf this time. Alright, so what's up with this guy? Nothing. Yeah, this reminds me of Batman a lot. It reminds me of detective mode. And the combat is very like, you know, dash and, and strike and dash and strike, you know what I mean? I can't do that without joining PC this. Golly, how you doing? Hold on, hold on. Oh, don't start rearing up now. Oh, this one's out there. Crow roach. Oh, this looks dangerous. Take it easy. This looks dangerous, man. Okay, let's see this. Oh, wow, there's a lot of easy win cards and champions you'll come across. Oh, yeah, I figure. I figure there's probably um, a champion in each town, in each inn. You know what I mean? And there's probably a couple other hidden places. Gas clouds are highly flammable. Ignite them. Oh, Roach, come back. Relax, Roach. Alright, let's get out of here again. I just came out here to see what that question mark was. It was apparently a, a treasure chest. Nothing big. Alright, if you look, I cleared out all of these question marks right here. That's a lot of them. I'm fine, thanks. My shoulder is broke again and I'm going to be home for a week at least. You? Dude, I'm doing great, Zagal. I'm doing really, 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 really good. No complaints whatsoever. Whatsoever. Yeah, I've been enjoying a lot of uh, new games and stuff. Um, things have been going good for me. Uh, let's see. Been playing uh, this. Been playing Red Dead 2. I picked up Elder Scrolls Online. I've been really kind of itching for more um, adventure roleplay style games, you know? Yeah, how'd you break it? Let's go check these out. There's a lot over here. Alright, let's go to the, um, the road and then make a left and switch up the road. Get up. Go, Roach. Come on, Roach. Yeah, there's the, the soldiers. Hi, soldiers. Whoa. Hey, there's some weird 
noises coming out of there. Yeah, I, I, I listen to noises a whole lot in games. Go, and, go. And, and this game, I noticed the ambient background noise when you're inside the woods and stuff is like insane. Like when I'm inside like a forest, it's just nothing but wood cracking noises everywhere. It sounds like you're being stuck up by a thousand people stepping on twigs. You know? Yeah, how did you break your shoulder? I see young guy. Aren't you like a young man? <laughs> I have to talk to Vesemir to continue the main mission because that's the only one I have open is the main mission. So I don't want to do that yet. I want to go around and, and clear out some of these guys. Right, let's head to Broken Bridge. Yeah, that's where the Griffin attack was. Oh, let me pull up my sword just to be on the safe side. You can see the griffin came down here and smashed the crap of like a horse and a car and just destroyed them. And so this is the thing that I'm going to be fighting. Look, he was able to break these trees. It's a plenty strong creature. And then you hear those background noises I'm hearing? The, the, there's a ton of them in the woods. They bug me. Alright. i got to get across there before I call Roach. Oh, wait, he can get across. You see the dots on the map? This is from Google Translate. Course, no idea is correct. No, I've got circulatory membrane stenosis. Circulatory membrane stenosis. Oh. Oh, Hassan. Hey, how you doing, man? Hey, thank you for the tip. What's up, buddy? I'm playing some Witcher. This game is really cool. I like um, RPGs like this, and I, um, I watched the Witcher series. Um, uh, on, on Netflix recently, and it was so cool that it just made me want to kind of uh, jump back into this series, you know? The Witcher series is great. If you haven't watched it, I really recommend it. There's only seven episodes or some shit like that, you know? Uh, but um, it's one of those things that I'm going to, like, rewatch already. Medallion's humming. Place of power. It's got to be. Where is the... Oh, there's no Wraith at this point. I have two ability points to spend. I forgot I didn't spend the other one. Okay. I got some ability points to spend. Let's do that really quick. That is in this screen under character in here. Mutagens. Alright. Okay, I select the mutagens tab. Gotcha. Choose a mutagen and place it in the indicated slot. So my mutagens I have are... I've never used a mutagen before. No, no. Okay, yeah. I guess I'll just have to accept it. It's going to go in this slot. Uh, so it's a mutagen of vitality plus 50. So my character is just basically uh, a little bit stronger. Um, it's a slot they haven't been able to do anything with in the game so far. So... Um, yeah, it's pretty good. Cool. And then both mutagen and abilities are marked with color, but a mutagen in a field with at least one ability of the same color to increase its bonus. Oh, okay, I see how it's chained with that little green line connecting the two. It shows that they're working in conjunction with each other. If an ability does not match the color of the mutagen in its field, it does not increase the mutagen's bonus. This increased gain from any other abilities in the same field which do not match the mutagen remains. The increased gain from any other... Okay, okay. So if I get all three going green, then he gets like a super bonus. If I get only two going green, then he gets a mild bonus. And if they're all three different colors, then you get like no bonus. I get that. I'll say, hey, old man, I love that episode. Hey, son, it's great. Hi, Paper. I'm going to watch the first season again before I watch season two. You're on episode four now. It puts lore together so well. It really does. I played Witcher 2, and I didn't care about Witcher 2. I was like, eh, it's okay, you know, but I didn't care about it. I'm not saying I hate it. I'm just saying I wasn't like invested. But after watching the show, it's like, dude, I, I love the show. I have to sneeze. There it goes. Gosh. I know, I sneeze fucking weird. Shush. 
Oh, bomb creation. I kind of wanted to make a bomb earlier. Not, uh, let's see. Not yet next week. Going to do a CT. And after that, we uh, decide what to do. If fin docs don't want to surgery shoulders for the same anymore, it's the last option because healing time is so long. Really? I know surgery time is a long healing process, but wanting that long is waiting that long is can make healing even longer if they wait. That's true. All right, so I think it wants me to spend points on green stuff so that I can combine the green with the mutagen. You know what I mean? But green is is this stuff, which is all. That just withstands poisons. You grant them by and it was the extraction of mutagens from the corpses of powerful monsters. Oh, that's neat. Can I? Can, okay, so this is the one that I think goes under that line. Yeah, every known uh, a lot of formula increases toxins. I don't use alchemy a lot, but I mean, I, I probably will by the way this game works, you know? I'm gonna buy that one. I do like alchemy in most games. And let's put this over here. Now I got this green line connecting the two. So I get um, an extra uh, bit of health or something, I guess. Mm -hmm. and this only adds 5% to my, uh, my fast attack damage, which is not a whole lot. can't buy level two of that yet either i would buy level two maybe just use that all right let's go all green um what is this if toxicity is above zero time automatically slows when an enemy is with a form of counterattack. oh oh okay so if you're poisoned at all then uh time slows down when your enemy is counterattacking. that's pretty cool time is slowed for the 50 percent while aiming bombs eh. Uh, oil applied to blades give a 3% chance of poisoning the target on each hit. The chance is greater the higher the level of oil used. Increased potion overdose threshold from 75% to 80%. Wow. Let's do that, that toxicity thing. I want to get all three greens all working together, you know? <sighs> Whammy. So I get an extra 150 vitality. You thought a cat attack my CC? I sneeze freaking weird, I know, man. <laughs> my sister's husband had a bad shoulder injury. Uh, they waited to operate on it, and he has problems with this day because they waited. Mm. My wife is interrupting me. Oh, yeah, it's okay. All right, so I spent the points. We went all green this time, and it's giving me um, this thing where if I'm poisoned a little bit, then, um, uh, let's see, um, Oh, I'm sorry, this one where um, all of my uh, alchemy formula increases maximum toxicity level by one. Whatever. Whatever. It affects my alchemy. All right, so there was this one, and then there's another question mark just right over here. See that? Let's go get that guy, too. I don't know what he is. I'm assuming it's a he. I'm assuming this marker's gender. Because I am a uh, worse than him. Is it a bandit camp? It is. Which one was the, um, the brain? There we go. Don't let him touch you! Oh. With bigger lads! Ah. Bigger! Oh. their friends in the little pieces. That's great. I like that. I know there's another guy down there still. I'll clear him up in a second. Last one's the archer. And he's not shooting at me. But he's over here. Holy fuck, that was great. That was really good, guys. 
I just want to say you can get an opinion from another doctor. Just keeping the options open. Let's see. So it's just a bandit camp. I like how he just comes up and starts murdering people without even asking them any questions about what they're doing or nothing. Uh, cured leather, alkahest, um, diagram of vellum longsword, torn out akinda decoction, some cavalry boots with a master item. Okay, I'd probably have to be a higher level to actually use them. But I'll save them. And, uh, I like that. I like that he can just turn on fire and turn off fire anytime he wants. Some silver. Air villus. And Tamarian rye. Alright. I think I gotta slice some pieces. That area is cleared out. This is a big chunk right here. You see this? Well, let's start riding to it. Roach, come here. Oh, you can hop on it backwards like that. Move That's it. Great. making a humming sound. Oh, it's the thing. Run, Roach. It's recharged. <clears throat> I can, um, it will give me another ability point, but it will recharge up my, one of my skills. I got a humming sound. Well, that's cool. I don't know if it's permanent or if it's kind of like, uh, like oblivion. Or Come on, Roach. Like a, where it's just like a temporary boost. Either way. I just gotta keep my eye out for cliffs. There's my abandoned village. This is where, um, where the ghost was, but we killed the ghost. Ghost was circling this. Slow this, now. Whoa. This well, but um, we had to free her spirit. Let's see. I want to talk about Corazon injections, but they aren't super triggered at all. Oh, I imagine Corazon are just a uh, relief. You know what I mean? Whoa there, Roach. Music on that part reminds me of um, I don't know the name of the song, but it's like this music. Not so they fast, use, Roach. They use in the movie Platoon. Kind of reminds me of it right there. That doo -doo -doo -doo. Anyways, yeah, that's part of fun. Oh shit! I didn't mean to do that. There you go. I don't know if Silver Sword or or, or Steel Sword is better for this guy. For this part. Man. Okay, that did nothing to me. This sword. I guess it was just a couple guys like walking the road up more than anything else. Let's take some food so I don't get too low also. Come here, horsey. Most five second annoying moment of my life. How big is this game? This game is huge, Hassan. 
Um, they're saying that this game is like 600 hours of gameplay if, if you want to do all the side quest stuff, you know. Um, I've tackled games like this in the past, though. Um, Skyrim, Oblivion, Morrowind, Mass Effect 1, 2, and 3, games like that, you know. They're fun to jump into. Dragon Age, um, I didn't do 2, but I did Dragon Age 1 and 3, because everyone said 2 sucks, so I just kind of skipped it. This game is, uh, if you talk about um, uh, uh, size, I think it's like 84 gigabytes or something like that. One thing I don't like though is um, my walk speed and walk animations, they feel a little janky. I like a lot about this game, but that's one thing that kind of bugs me a little bit. Oh wait, shit, there's a, this right here, hold on. Let's go ahead and scan this. Yeah, see, there's a couple loot. A candelabrum. And a rusty bread knife. Alright. I'm gonna walk out to wherever this thing is. What's that? That's just a rock. Alright. Make sure I wasn't about to find my first bear. <laughs> Place of power should draw from it. I will, but there's something over here. Oh, it is a bear! Oh my god, that's a fucking bear, dude. Do you think the bear's gonna kill me? We're saving really quick, okay? Cause that, cause that. I, I just saved. No multiplayer, no, it's just a single player game. Just a single player game. Alright, there's a bear there, man. <gasps> oh my god, look at it. Which one of these would be best for him? I think I can influence his mind. He didn't take well to his mind being influenced. so into parrying just because I know I don't know the speed of their attack so the parry is kind of hard for me to Meat, bear hide, bear fat, but the bigger gift is this um, this power thing, you know. Oh, let's see. Um, rapid motorcycle. He was riding his heart at home late at night. It had been raining. He worked in an oil field company. Damn it. On 3 a.m. I don't know. It's in the street. We ran a red light. Hit the brakes. Ooh, fuck. Yeah, so, um, Hassan, as far as, like, 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 actual size size, I don't know, like, how big the world is, you know? But this is, like, the first level, is they give you this, this huge map to fuck with. But then I'm gonna go to different maps all the time, so, like, um, like, this is just this area, but, uh, 
uh, some random village, but we're going to go to, like, we're inside the, the kingdom of... I forget what the whole kingdom's called, but Nilfgaard um, has taken over um, Sentra. We look like, um, as far as the Witcher show goes, we look like we are, like, decades down the line because the world is controlled by a, by a specific faction now, you know? And so it kind of looks like... Um, a lot of Nice ability point. And, um, I can't unlock another of these. Unlock's level four. I'm at level three and a half. I did beat up level six bear. That's cool. Let's go ahead and start unlocking these two. And um, see, I only have a green mutagen. If I had a red mutagen, what is this? That's an orange mutagen. So that's one of these. If I had a red one, a red would be awesome because then I can link it with these. I have to check something. Okay, I'm just checking the checking the Discord. Oh wait, I forgot to do my Witcher. There you go. Tracker boots. Oh, you know what? I've picked up a lot of gear recently, and I haven't equipped any of it. I really should equip my new gear. So. I don't really follow the um, the uh, resistances as much as I follow the armor ratings. So, so each um, item has like an armor rating, and then it has resistances to piercing, bludgeoning, slashing, burning, different elemental types, that kind of stuff. These look like much better boots than the ones I have. They have 10 armor, which is up three more than my other armor. Um, these are only up one. Still good boots. And these are... Um, Damaged, I think that says, and then they're up one. It's a master item. Interesting. So is this. Well, we're gonna wear these boots. I like how they visually change on you too. That's nice. I remember in the old games, you would change outfits and the armor never would change. You know what I mean? Like Cloud always looked like Cloud no matter what he put on him, that kind of thing. And these pants, um, they're the same as my other pants, it looks like. Six two two three, and that's uh, Pierce Bludgeon Slash. Six two two three, Pierce Bludgeon Slash. They're the same, same. The ones I'm wearing have a higher um, uh, repair on them, also. So even the ones I'm wearing are better. Uh, what about these gloves? The gloves are the same uh, as far as an armor rating goes. Four armor with the two Bludgeon Two Slash. Oh, this has four armor, two bludgeon, two slash, and one burning. So these are even better than the ones I'm using right now. These guys... It says I can put them in the sockets of stuff. And it gives me, like, resistance and shit. Right now, I'm not even, like, measuring what I'm putting them in. I'm just throwing, putting them in shit, you know? Okay, yeah. Later on, I'll, I'll start figuring out which elementals will help me most wear. But for right now, it's just kind of a crapshoot. Okay, where am I going from here? That's where we're going. Did he just come up a cliff or something? Come on, Roach. Come on, Roach. I'm gonna keep whistling until you get here. That bear, I killed that bear. I killed it, man. Proud of you, Roach. The deer. Oh, drowners. All right. Go wreck them.
that's gonna blow up. Hey, why did it blow up? It's okay. I, I, we just went over that. Some dark iron ore oil, split bolt, and a formula for Rebus. And in here, a saddle. Oh, nice. Saddle's like 200 um, uh, ornaments. Hey. Let's see. Wexio, hey, how you been, man? Good to see you. Uh, he's still telling me how to shoot over 500 yards. Now I cannot drink him, so he's teaching me how to shoot over 750 yards. I bet you I could throw a football over that mountain. <laughs> <laughs> you see, um, what fucking movie was that? Napoleon Dynamite? That, was, that might have been my favorite line in the movie. How much you want back to throw this football over that mountain? <laughs> Alright, drown her brain. It's just loot. Where's the next nearest uh, question mark? It's across the river, and there's one on the bridge, so... Actually, I'll do that. Come on, rope. Make our way over to that bridge. Bridge, you saw there was um, there's like noises everywhere. Like if I stop moving, what am I hearing? I hear like pop, 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 pop. Okay, just smoke with loot. Or, or scraps and emerald dust. Nice scraps and the black pearl dust. Okay, so somewhere along the river, they're throwing their loot in here, and they're coming and collecting at the gate. I think is what's going on. Or something went wrong in like when they're like you know drop offs, and it just happens to be collecting there, and I stumbled on it. But either way, that's pretty cool. Man, I, I got a lot of this done already, you know? Your brother taught you how to shoot 750 yards? <laughs> yeah. How's the game coming out? Is it looking good? Is the picture staying clear? I'm always on about that. So this is um, a monster nest, and I need to get grape shot bombs or dancing star bombs. I don't know how to do either of those yet. I don't know how to make them. You know. Alright, so there's these guys and there's those. Let's make our way over here. Let's follow this left side road. Get up. Go, Roach. Look at those. Those uh, uh, pillars, they're like perfect for like an ambush, just wait for you, you know what I mean? Not so fast, Roach. Make sure I'm on the right path here. 
No, I'm not. Because I'm a dummy. But I can take this fast travel to Crossroads. So these signposts right here, the fast travels, they let you go from signpost to signpost. Since I'm trying to get to up here, uh, Crossroads seems to be the closest one, which is this guy. Let's see. When the ambulance took him, he was hanging on 7% of his life only and made a motorcycle. Said, oh shit. There's a valley of sorts in the old ranch where my dad shot a deer one time. They checked in. It was 732 yards, and I was down to the top of the hill. Oh, okay. He was in a coma for like a month on machines. Damn, that's a long time. You know, m most of the time when I hear about comas lately, I hear, it's always like, oh, he was in so much pain, they put him in a forcible coma. You ever hear about those? It's just crazy, man. I'm rubbing my sword out. Oh, you know what? I am low on health. Let's regenerate really quick. My dried fruits and nuts are great food. I see some foods work better than others, apparently. And it's starting to get darker out. I don't really like when it's dark, but you can do something about that. There's meditation. I haven't been interrupted meditating yet by like a creature or anything, so I think it's, I think it's safe. I think the world just kind of stops. Let's see. Oh, a little building here. Right in the middle of nowhere. I might have found it before. There's almost nothing in here. I might have found this building before. Let's see. This was a real shot my dad made. Hundred all the time. Why can't my dad make it? Eight critical surgical operations. Baker, remember that? I think I do. Damn, how's your now, son? Titanium on his whole body. Yeah, I remember that. I remember that. You can made a joke about him being Wolverine now. I don't need to go to the road. I can just go straight north from here. You I mean, see how the road's just kind of a distraction at this point. Oh, crap. Maybe not. Oh, there, there it is. It's an object of power. That's like a fort behind me. All right, and there's these three guys, which, okay. Hi. How you like that silver? Oh, he's a level two boy. said to destroy the nests? I don't know. Okay. So this is not really a road. <gasps> Ooh. 
My goodness, don't fall. I found out it's easy to fall down stuff in this game. Huh. It looks like I'm stuck over here for a minute. This cliff is crazy. He's good now, but in winter he cannot handle cold weather. Yeah, I imagine. My dad had a rod to fix his femur, but that's all he got to keep. That is kind of protein here. Hmm. Okay. So I got... I didn't kill the nest, but I did get the, the thing of power here. You know, the place of power. You can only destroy the nest by getting, like, bombs, apparently. I don't know how to make bombs. That's another undiscovered location. All right, well, the road's right here, apparently. That's not a road. That's a big cliff. Crossroads to Ford, and then uh, walk over to the marker. It's over there in the woods. Come on, Roach, let's go to these dark, scary woods. Oh, did you hear that? Some wolves. I see a little bit of food. It's just bandits. Let's see what's going on. People in the streets, they don't care about motorcycles. He's overweight and hates ladders. Eh. My brother's 88 too. He got two boys. 88? Uh, that accident happened when his younger boy was just born. I'm only 32. My dad turned 80 this year. His age was three weeks only. I'll be 32 next month. I'm old. You're 41. Huh. <laughs> Not really for us. Well, I can't take on myself, really. Huh? Okay, I got a rope ladder, a small blackjack, a blackjack? What they're showing you right there really isn't a blackjack. So what a blackjack is, it's a, it's a small leather bag, and inside of it has like stones or metal plates. Or, or it's, it's not always a metal bag, sometimes it's um, leather flaps, and at the end of them they have metal plates, and it's for smacking someone in the back of the skull so you can like knock them out. You know like in old gangster movies when they have that little, looks like a little black sock and they hit someone with it? That's what a blackjack is. Now, what they're showing in here is kind of more like a flail or something, which is fine, I guess, you know. It's not really a blackjack. It's some kind of a, of a club. Alright. Anything else around here? Oh, okay, just loot. See, that's more, of a, that's more of a club. This is like a bat. This is a bat. That's a rabbit. So the rabbits, I just end up uh, shooting my fire thing at them, and you get cooked meat. Oh, uh, who am I missing? There you go. So I got a bunch of swords to sell. 
They're not worth a lot. They look like one or two or in each, but you know, what else are you doing? Okay, so everything in the south is cleared out. All that's left are these five guys in the north here. See that? And then doing the, the griffin itself. This is what I don't like. I don't like in the middle of the ocean like that. I hate swimming in games. I feel so vulnerable. Alright. Let's go to Mill. Right, let's go. To go, go. Go, go. It's this I want to explore, and this I want to explore. Actually, let's go to the garrison first. No? No, we'll do that last. We'll go to mill first. You need to sleep now, too. Looking at what time it is, I wish I could stay longer. I'll see you all next time. Oh, paper. That's good armor. That's better than what I got. This is six armor with two, two, and two for bludgeoning, slashing, and burning. And this one is um, four with two, two, and one for bludgeoning, slashing, and burning. So it's better not only in the um, in the armor department, but also in the resistances. All right. What about these pants? Two, two, and three with a six. Two, two, and three with a six. Okay, those are the same. What about my boots? Those are not as strong of a defense. The same thing with those. And the same thing with those. Okay, so I've got the best things on right now when it comes to boots. Swords. Oh, wait. Is those quick sword items? Aha. Nine thirty-five. Only 48. Yeah. Pretty cool, man. Oh yeah, the Conan server should still be up. You can't see it? It might need an update then. It might need an update. Um, uh, I'll update it in a little bit here. Um, if it hasn't been updated, then the, the, um, the games won't match, and so it won't see it. So um, <clears throat> I haven't been on in a few days, so uh, I'll update the server um, in a little bit here. But yeah, they're still going. Uh, both, both servers are still going.
The way they approached though in a, in a, in a unit, that was pretty cool. There they are. Camera wolves. Every time I use my my Witcher vision, I can hear them, but like really far away, and it's distracting. I got some resin. And here's a bunch of loot. You see all this? Some orins, a vial, a vial, oil, water, water for drinking. Scrawl Notes, which looks like a quest item. Lesser Triglav Boots and another saddle, empty bottle, dagger, and precision bolts, which is a uh, launch about a crossbows, and a torn up page, grave hag the coffin, just like a spell, I think, you know? Let me read the chat again. You can cook, which is pretty good. I need to sleep not too looking at what time it is. I wish I could stay longer. I read that. Sleep time, bacon, I read that too. Uh, I read all this. You need to do something? You mean like play? Hold on, let me check the servers. Let me check the servers, man. It just takes me a second, okay? Blue Fang Solutions. Overseer Panel. Alright, I'm uh, updating uh, the, the Isle of Pork one, okay? Give that one a few minutes and we'll see... Um, we'll see what happens. What What's happening? Oh, yeah, I think I got a sub. Add me gaming, how you doing? Thanks for the sub, man. Alright, so I I told the um, the server to to check for a steam. Oh shit! Quest completed, drive funds. I didn't know this was a quest. So I've got this one and then these two, which that's weird to have two next to each other like that. It makes me double nervous. It's okay, we'll cook it. But all right, let's go see what this thing is first. Welcome, Bacon Society, Adby. <laughs> yes. Hunting trousers. You're over to girl with three items. Oh, okay. Oh wait, how did I, I didn't read how I did the thing? Oh, the two saddlebags. Oh, how do I put things in the saddlebags, man? Because otherwise I'm just going to drop stuff. I don't want to just drop stuff. There's alchemy inventory, which kind of feels like it would be in here. Salad bag's empty. Can I drag stuff over there? No. Can I drag these over there? No. Ooh. You can see the server now. Okay, cool, cool. Ah, you're welcome, Abby. Can I drag these over there? So I can't put things in a cell bag that way. So that's that's just dumb. I should stop doing that. Okay. Oops. No, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, my shells are fine then. Uh. It's just all best theory, books, tutorials. What are these books? I got a bunch in here that I picked up that I haven't like read yet. I read the Emperor's Letters. I read the old diary, letter from Witcher, Colgrim, and the Viper Skull read that. That taught me like a sword or something. Interrogation report, Brother Missing. Okay, I already read all those then. Never mind.
Let's kind of get up this game. It's an amazing game. Oh, Adby, well then maybe you can help me. How do I um, take inventory from myself and put it on my horse? You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Because hmm. that would be great if I can know how to do that. At first, I thought I would just like do this, you know, be like, whoop, but no, see, that's not it. That's the first black crow thing from the beginning. to see if he's got an answer about how I move stuff in my inventory. Otherwise, I'm going to throw like a sword or a club to away. Because they're really not worth a whole lot. I'm just bringing them to like and sell them, you know? Actually, I'm, I am going to drop a couple. Whoop. And whoop. I started thinking about it. If I put it in my saddle, I'm never going to take it out and sell it. I'm just going to put it in there and keep it forever. Like a dummy. Alright, let's get going. Burning wolf skin. You can only place it in the assigned box. Arm for arm and rest thing. Oh, okay. Alright. Then let's get going. Um, you know what I should do is I should go and sell a bunch of this crap and just solve my problem. Uh, who sells... Right there is the dude who buy it. And I'm up here. Ah, just west really quick. Then to mill and then down. Alright, let's go this way. Whoa there, Roach. Whoa, Roach. Yeehaw. Um, and then there's Mill. That's it, Roach. I like this windmill. It kind of reminds me of, like, Army of Darkness. The windmill in the... There's a windmill in that movie in that one of those scenes. It reminds me of that. You know, I picked up a couple of weird keys. And if I remember right, this door is locked. I wonder if I read that keys were unlocked or not. Oh, wait, no, it wasn't this building. Oh, yeah, it was. It was down there. Now I remember. It was this guy. I can unlock it now. Nice. So I got Temerian Rye, Temerian Special Forces Insignia. Three of them. I don't know what they do. Uh, Scribble Document, 31 Crowns, and a Nilfgaardian Nilf Longsword. I've already kind of like scavenged this room before, but I picked up a key since then, so I'm, I'm glad that the key turned out to be for that, you know? It's only items under the saddle, which are lower power. The rest of the items do not take up any space in the saddle. Okay. also locked? Why am I doing this really slow walk here? Oh, I'm, enc I'm encumbered again. That's why. <laughs> I'm all talking about it and I forget about it at the same time. Come on, drop it. Uh, it's got two more points to drop. Small black jacks. This one I'm keeping. Look at that. Heavy Mace uh, Master. Love it. Yeah, I've been dragging that for a while. Uh, this is garbage. That's old. All right, cool. I don't know if you're supposed to be able to jump that. All right, let's just stay locked. The noises this thing makes. That's creepy. If you think about it, it would, like when the arm's coming this way, all the gravity's like pulling it down this direction, right? And then when it swoops over and goes the other way, the arm's pulling it the opposite direction, so all the way like flexing the other way. Like, that would probably get some workout. You know? 
Don't drop. Sell them. Well, I gotta get to a merchant, yeah? And I was all like walking slow through garbage. So I'm trying Whoa, to get to a merchant real quick. Unless Faster. there's a way to sell it without going to a merchant, which I don't know about. That would be great. Move it! Why are all the peasants always just sitting around crying? <laughs> Alright, let's see. Merchant here. There's one at that, um... There's one inside the town. He's the blacksmith. Go buy it. Oh, and this guy too. Cool, two merchants here. Greetings. Greetings. This guy with the bowl haircut. This guy's so weird looking. Let me have a look at your stock. Okay, let's start selling some stuff. Yeah, that gets sold. That's garbage. That's garbage. I'm going to sell anything that's pretty much underneath what I'm currently using, you know? Oh, I'm keeping my Witcher Steel Sword. I don't know if there's any reason to keep the original one, but I'm keeping it anyways. Those are nice. I like mine better. Yeah, I'm just getting rid of everything that is. Uh, don't worry about timing. It's a long haul game. A lot of running. Yeah. So yeah, just getting rid of low level armors. Stuff I'm probably never going to use. What about these runestone upgrades? Do I need this many? Will I eventually turn them into something else I can I can sell, you know, one day instead? I mean, he's got a lot of orins on him. He's got 302. I've got a lot of saddles. Oh, yeah, skins. I don't know if uh, I, I, if it's like, dude, keep the skins, but I've just been selling, like, all the skins, you know? I'll keep that bear one, just because it's kind of rare, but it's probably useless, but I'm just going to keep it anyways for now. Let's see, junk. I, I, it keeps saying something about dismantling them. I wonder if I should just dismantle some of these things instead of selling them, you know? Don't sell runes that come in handy in upgrades? Okay. Okay. It's only worth seven, but I can dismantle it probably into silver, so I'm going to save that guy. Yeah, that goes... I don't recognize every icon yet, so I, I gotta kind of read through them as I go. I think it's not gonna dismantle the rope ladders, so I'm actually gonna do that. Can we sold for a significant sum or dismantle the crafting components? Magic items, silver, amber, necklace. You need those skins and other stuff in alchemy. Oh, well, these things happen. <laughs> It's just too much for a one man to carry. I got all this crap. I got a lot of this crap. It's my dog tallow. Yeah, I, was say, I, I gotta have like a gajillion dog tallow right now. So long. Take care. The ground told me about the school. Lad went missing one day, so folks had a witch and it was time to use. Started poking and asking. But he started twisting and squirming, so wham bam, they knocked his head off. Aye, right, so it worked. Except it was some drowner that had sat on the cliff. Witcher had nothing to do with it. What did the folk do? It ain't like they could have sewed his head back on. Word is they laid his corpse to rest. Hush hush on the cliff. The the women in this not even the women, all the people in this, they're so weird. I should say this. Like I had like a little boy go by and when I said hi to him he goes, Peace <laughs> off. <laughs> Sword wants two. Uh oh. One, two, three, 
Always crying. Oh, what's wrong with these people? Loar and I think. Yeah, I was gonna come and sell to this guy. A return customer. Welcome. What can I do for you? So this thing? he, when I came into town, he was the local blacksmith. I needed to talk to him for some unrelated thing, and you find him crying. And he's crying because his house is burnt down. And he's like decades of work, and you ask what happened. He's like, you see, I'm the only blacksmith around. So when war happened, the North Guardians, when they invaded, they told me, made me uh, do the work for them. They don't give me money; they just give me materials and tell me when they want it done by. And so I work basically for free for them. But because of that, the locals hate me for that. They think I'm making a million dollars and I'm just storing it somewhere and being cheap. And so one of the locals burn his fucking house down in the middle of the night. So you do a mission where you have to like go in and find the guy that burned it down and um, and turn him in or let him go. I turned him in because I'm a dick. Hey, Greedy, what up? Oh, the cows? I don't want to do the cows. Someone warned me about the cows. Uh, let's see... I don't need to craft anything for me. Show me your wares. Show me what you Show got. Show me what you got. <laughs> That's on purpose. Uh, nothing I'm after, really. I mean, I don't understand what most of these uh, alchemy ingredients do yet, so I'm not like necessarily looking for them. And then the same thing with the diagrams. These are like sort of like crafting, you know, spells in a way, like or like a like a schematic, I guess. Well, I'm not after any of this stuff. And this is shit I sold him. Sorry, I'm getting tired. I get tired easily lately. Fair. Oh. Like you to forge something for me. I hit the wrong button. Oh, those are not as good as the ones I'm using. Okay, I can actually make some armors which are a little bit stronger than some of the ones I'm using. Like, my chest armor is only blech right now, apparently. Ooh, look at that. If I had one more cured leather and two threads, I can make that. Should I make that really quick? Should I make that? Oh, you like my background light? Thanks, man. I picked it up off of, um... Off Amazon for like 15 bucks, like real cheap, you know. And then when I got it, it was supposed to have like a phone app that was supposed to work from like 30 meters away. And uh, I bought it and like I turned it on and it wouldn't fucking work. And so I get it like all super close and it wouldn't change the lights. So I'm like holding the phone like on the actual light and it wouldn't change the light color. And then finally it worked like once. And so I told it just do rotating colors slow. And so um, I can plug it in, it works, but my app. I don't know, the Bluetooth on the inside don't like to connect right, you know? Okay, um, thinking about this. This outfit... I, it lowers my damage from monster resistance. And it lowers my elemental damage resistance. But it, it, it um, significantly increases my slashing, bludgeoning, and piercing damage. So it's good against fighting against humans, is kind of what it's saying. Because they're the ones who use the weapons, and then this, uh, but it, um, does nothing against monsters. Apparently I'm wearing something right now that's meant for monsters. It's a haft. Okay, whatever. I don't want a haft. Oh, you guys know each other? Cool, man. This is meant for more for people. Plus, it looks dumb. All right, I'm not building that. Because I'm getting to the end of this area. So long. We're um, kind of filtering down to the Griffin real soon here. Because basically, um, Got a lump of bread today. if this is like Witcher 2, then they'll put you in an area with a main goal. And then to get to the goal, you have to do a secondary main larger Slay a Monster quest. Basically, the mayor will say, I'll only help you if you slay my monster and so you have to focus on the monster and then they give you sub quests to get to the monster and then you find secondary quests but the secondary quests usually help equip you for the monster either by finding more armor or ammo ammo armor or weapons or um just by simply leveling up you know and so 
um, it, it kind of encourages you to explore the whole place. What is this? Abandoned site. Oh. Oh. Okay. I got to go down there and kill something because um, uh, I guess enough uh, monsters have chased people away from it. Something like that. You got to go eat, get some food later. Abdi, later on, man. Thanks for popping by. It's very nice of you for subbing. I'll see you soon. My dad had a sword once, too. My dad too. had a sword once, but then he was chopped in a little soul bits. Got a lump of bread today. Little soul bits. Let's see. Boosh. I don't like nighttime. It's hard to see. Everything's gonna be fine. Come on, Roach. Uh, yeah, we're cool, man. Take it easy. She's just a peasant. It's cool. That's it, Roach. She's not real people. We're real people. Faster. You hear all that cracking noise? That's just the noise of the woods. Looks like it should have been like a, like a place of power. What? I killed all you guys. Oh! I guess it didn't count as finishing that. Or is it the same one? Or was this the abandoned place and I just kind of stumbled on it anyways? Oh, the noise. Carol's heart is warm and happy. Area liberated. The populace has returned. Okay, that was the place. That was the place. No big deal. Oh no, the abandoned village? I already took care of that. That was the um, the noon wraith and the the night wraith, and you had to find the bracelet in the water and then burn the body and then put the oil on the sword and trap her in the trap. Yeah, that one was fun. But I had to fight her still. I was hoping I wouldn't have to, but it still made me. Look, I've done most of the question marks on this map. Right now I'm just hunting down the last couple and then all that's left is the, um, the griffin, you know? Hold on. Game's too loud then. I'll do that. Hopefully that fixes it a little bit. This game's kind of hard to balance that way because uh, parts of it would be loud and then parts of it would be quiet. And uh, I noticed um, like my intro music is really quiet but then the game gets like super loud at points. So it always needs adjusting. Those are bandit camps. There's that one. All right, let's head to a bandit village. Go take the fast uh, travel. Out of the way, Pex. this thing? I don't think I've actually stopped by this particular building. Oh, I obviously didn't. Ah, uh, fishing stuff. It is dark out right now. Oh, there's a lot of stuff in here. A valent longsword, a master sword, a valent longsword, a goat hide, fishing rod, a pearl, and a dried fish. I take it dried fish is like a food, probably, you know? That's not a big leap of logic for that one. Oh, shit. So, guys, do you see what's going on with this place? This place is not a happy place. There's a dude hanging in the middle of the room. I walked right past him and didn't even notice. 
wonder who hung this guy. There's no hint of it or anything. Just a dude that got hung. Poor guy. That's better. Okay. Move it. Move it. I don't mean to rope sometimes, man. So yeah, he is probably the boyfriend that That's gave, it, Roach. They gave her the bracelet, you know? Because the lady that was here, I had to burn her body. She was a ghost. Um, she was like in love, but then like... I guess like like I said, the story was like the mayor, we'll just make it easy. Whoa there, Roach. The mayor came down and like uh, fucking shot her cow because he was drunk or something simple like that. And so she talked to the governor. She's like, the mayor shot my cow. The governor's like, mayor, you owe her money. So the mayor's like, I'll come down and I'll apologize. But he came down and he fucking hung her. Hung her in the well. And her arm broke off off her skeleton. And the bracelet fell into the water. And so that was part of why her spirit was really at, at unease. So you had to take the bracelet, put it on the body, take the body, do a spell, burn it. And then the spirit came out. It was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. All right. What is the next one to go to? Let's do this guy, the Nifgardi Garrison. Because there's that thing in the water nearby. <laughs> kind of a weirdo laughs Get like away. that. Right, fine. Alright, it's over there. It's behind me. out there. Is this shallow enough for me to walk out there? No. It's that boat, isn't it? No. What is it? There's gas out here. It's not close enough. There's a wolf right there. Okay, Stamelford's Dust, Repair Kit, Leather, Sap, runestone, Straps, and a Hardened Leather. Yeah, I'll take all that. I'm pretty sure what I need to get is still out there. So I'll make my way out there. Oh, look. It came back. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I didn't expect it to hurt. Wait, no, no. Not, not silver. Regular sword. Let's go kill that wolf. Another wolf. Is that all? I right, just a couple wolves. Have I already been here? If you look, this stuff's already got gotten. All right, so it wants me to go out there. I think what it is, it's in the boat. I just hate swimming, dude. Swimming makes me feel like uneasy in video games. Also, let's make it daytime. So I just hate nighttime in games. Oh, whoop. Not the ones to kill me? All right. It's in that boat, isn't it? Oh, gosh. I just don't like the way swimming feels in games. on the shore.
the rest is just that stink root stuff that I need for the griffin. But I got plenty of that shit right now. All right. Well, that was kind of lame. I came all the way out for that. All right, so all that's left are these two and this one. I can't break those until I learn how to make bombs, um, which I guess I have to spend an ability point to do, most likely. All right, let's make our way back to the, the garrison thing, and then we'll tell a fast travel to mill, and then we'll ride up there. We'll see what those are. I didn't want to call Roach out on that beach. I don't know why. But you know, I'm actually already back anyway, so let's just run. There's two there. Oh, no, there's, there's the two. There he is. Come here, Roach. Wait, I hear bees. Uh, they're a little bit high. No, why would you? Why would you turn that direction? Of all directions, to turn. You see. get these bees. Can I jump in queue? No. If I can burn the bees, and then I can, um, God, why is it so hard to walk? Got it. fall off. I pick it up for honeycomb. Big taste honeycomb. I probably wasn't supposed to be able to like stand on that stupid little thing. I think it felt a little glitchy, but whatever. You know what I mean? Whatever. W hat ever. This is back to where um, the game uh, I started. I had to kill a wraith here and then Place of um, power. Should yeah. draw from it. Yes, yes, so slightly increase my thing. It's not the burning point, I already got it. See, it's just me the intensity increases. I don't know if you only get one of those at a time or not. It kind of feels like you only get one at a time. But I'm not sure. I don't know if it's a permanent increase or like temporary blessing. I know I should probably just grab my horse, but I don't know why. I just kind of like running. Monster nest, huh? Shit. That means I need... I need bombs still. All right, heading back. Yeah, it's the bombs I need. All right, let's figure out how to make bombs then. Because really all I've got left on the map are these three um, monster um, uh, nests. Oh, this is the alchemist lady. Yeah? No? Oh, no, it's not. This is a locked building that looks like the alchemist lady. Never mind. I'm just looking around seeing if there's anything, anything else around here. I already checked out this building, which I was able to finally unlock that little thing underground. Alright. 
So like I said, all I got left to do are make bombs and then this one, which, all right. But what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna save that for later. I'm super sleepy. I've been waking up a little earlier lately and I've been going to bed a little bit earlier lately. And it's just kind of catching up with me again. So I'm gonna go ahead and, um, and wrap up the stream and save, um, save uh, more of this for tomorrow or the day after or something like that. So if you tune back in, I play lots of games. I don't just play Witcher. I play Witcher. I play Conan. I play Seven Days to Die. I play Overwatch. I play. Um, I, don't know, I play like a lot of games. Uh, changes all the time too. Uh, but um, Red Dead Two. I've been playing that lately. That's a lot of fun. Uh, but right now I'm looking mostly for games that have like nice graphic, graphical intensity. Uh, that's fun for me to uh, to run. You know, because my last computer couldn't run like some of these games, and the new one runs them well. I also picked up Among Us. Among Us is a lot of fun. If you guys haven't played Among Us, Among Us is like it's like five bucks or something. It's really easy. It's really simple. It's just a lying game. It's a uh, two people are um, killers, saboteurs, and then the rest of the team is trying to like accomplish like just shit on a spaceship while everyone else tries to break shit and then murder you, and then you take turns like guessing who it is and. You throw them out of the airlock, and you try to guess the right one. So it's like a lion game. Play Fall Guys! <laughs> I play Fall Guys sometimes. But I'm going to wrap this stream up, though, because I'm sleepy. I'm starting to slow down right now. Uh, but I'll be back later, guys. I'll be back later. I hope you enjoyed some of this Witcher. It might just be the, the music that's keeping me on the slowness, you know? On the slow. But, um, but it is a great game. It is a great game. There's so much to it. It's a beautiful game, though. My only complaint, like I said, is the walking animations are a little bit weird. Like, when I start, there's like a little, like, hiccup to it. And then it's kind of got that fast beat thing that, um... Like, humans shouldn't be able to do, like, some of this, this running around in a circle that you're doing here. They're a little strange. Eh, whatever. All right, guys. Witcher is one of your all-time favorites. The show is so good. Yeah, it's really good. I have almost every graphic on, but I didn't turn on the full sharpening because I noticed when I turned on the full sharpening, it started to look like crap. So I put on the the middle sharpening because that one keeps like a little bit of a softness to it. The other one was just too harsh. But uh, yeah, it's really cool, man. Play Among Us. I'll play Among Us. I'll play some Among Us. But for Witcher stream, Witcher stream is done. If I do some Among Us, keep an eye on the channel and I'll let you guys know. But I'm just going to take a break here. Uh, just because this game is doing the, the slow music. Alright, everybody. I'll be back later. Um, thank you for joining. You all have yourself a wonderful evening. And uh, I'll catch you in the next stream, okay?